Hey Crown Gang, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be talking about five things that I am doing differently this year for my hair so I can experience growth, y'all. I'm trying to be like the black Rapunzel or something. I'm trying to have some long, thick, just big old hair. If you're not already subscribed, you know the drill. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and we can go ahead and get this video started. The first thing that I'm doing, you guys, is I upped my water intake so much. I am very, very proud of myself. And this is not just for my hair benefit, but this is for my overall health benefit. I went from drinking maybe one to two bottles a day to drinking five to six bottles a day. It is that serious for me, you guys. Like, I'm just trying to live a healthier lifestyle, and I'm just hoping and praying, fingers crossed, that my hair benefits from it. More water intake. Guys, I recently purchased the Hair, Skin, and Nails Vitamin. This is by Nature's Bounty. I have heard so many good reviews about it. They're gummies. Take them twice a day. I only got the 30 day supply just to start off with it. If I like it, I will go ahead to Costco's and get that big old one. So for now, I'm going to try it. I'm going to do length checks here and there. Um, I don't know if I'm going to post them, I just want to see that they're actually working before I commit to buying a big old bottle, you know? So I will be doing a review on that, but that is another thing that I am doing this year for my hair. I have decided, you guys, like, I really want to properly detangle my hair because I feel like finger detangling just isn't enough, you know? My hair is very, very kinky, it's very coarse, and it's very thick, so I did get a better wide tooth comb. This one's from Conair. I got this from Walmart. I want to say I paid no more than two to three dollars for it, but it gets the job done. My problem area is my roots, you guys. My roots just, whew, honey. I break nails on my roots, and I'm like, I don't have time for it. And at the end of the day, I'm not even sure if my roots are properly detangled or not. And it's like, I just want my hair to be healthy and if that means I have to start using a wide tooth comb, so be it. I am using a wide tooth comb. And the last thing that I'm doing, you guys, is I bought a microfiber towel from Target. I want to pay, I uh, want to pay, I want to say I paid $6.99, $5.99 for this. It was very cheap. It has a button here. And it has a latch here, you guys. And I twist my hair while it's wet and I put it up. And the great thing about that is it doesn't 100% dry my hair, no. But it stretches my hair out a lot because, like I said, I twist my hair to like a giant bantu knot under it. And it dries my hair, I want to say, about 80 to 85%. So when I do stretch my hair, when I'm diffusing it, I went from using the diffuser for like at least an hour to using it for like 15-20 minutes and my hair is just dry. So that's less heat on my hair which is healthier, right? Right? So these are just some of the things that I'm doing you guys this year. I am really, really on a healthy hair journey. I just really want my hair to, to be like Rapunzel. Leave a comment below if you guys are doing anything different to your hair that is going to make it make your curls pop, just make your hair pop this year. Let's go ahead and get on this hair growth journey together. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Share if you think it'll give someone else inspired or any good ideas in this video. And don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.